My name is Matthew Wallace, and this is my digital portfolio for my internship at OMD M2M. Every year, OMD M2M and PhD as a collective run a four-week internship program during the university mid-semester break. This year, 20 interns were selected to partake in the program. 10 at OMD, 3 at M2M, and 7 at PhD. All of the companies are part of the Omnicom Media Group, one of the largest global media organisations. I was assigned to work at M2M. M2M operates within the OMD group and was established in 2008 to manage the Estee Lauder business, which was conflict brand for OMD. Since then, M2M has grown and has become more independent, however, remains part of OMD. OMD is currently the largest media agency in Australia, with clients such as McDonald's, Coles and Telstra. M2M manages some of OMD's global accounts, such as Apple, iTunes and Lexetica, with some of their own clients being Hoyts and Audible. That's a brief background to OMD M2M. I'll focus more on M2M and the team I worked with for the internship. The team. Business Director, Stephen Fuller. Account Director, Kathy Zwang. Account Executives, Ashley Hastings and Aaron Dimer. Media Assistant, Daniel Chesney. Head of Digital, Aurelian Simon. Digital Assistant, Molly Simpson. The Clients. The accounts my team managed were Luxetico and Hoyts. Luxetico included OPSM, Sunglass Heart, Oakley and Lorben and Paint. Our role was to provide our client with the best media opportunities for their brand in terms of cost, location, timing, and media platform. My role within the team. Compiled media responses. Hoyts briefed us on promoting their Lux Cinema, which is Gold Class's uh, equivalent for event. The media assistant and I sent the brief out to media owners of which suited what Hoyts was looking for. My understanding of media costs and the advantage and disadvantage of each media platform enabled me to do this. I then compiled their responses into a presentation format with a recommendation and we sent it to the client. Although I didn't see the end result, learning the different media owner companies and forming relationships with them will be beneficial if I choose to work in media. An interesting part of my internship was the brief we received from a potential new client, PetInsurance.com. They didn't want to use traditional advertising, so we had to find innovative media owners. We found several companies that do street activations, guerrilla advertising and really cool outdoor stuff. We received some really innovative ideas. Unfortunately, I wasn't there to see the end result. Participating in brainstorms. Brainstorming creative ideas for Hoyt's cinemas, digital and social media marketing was a highlight for me throughout the internship. To make decisions about strategy and content creation, you must truly understand the context in which the brand operates. Before the brainstorm, I ask to be given an overview of the brand, its competitors and its consumers. Knowing your audience is vital. It will direct you in developing your content. We identified our primary target as families with a secondary target being millennials. We wanted to come up with an exciting uh, with exciting ideas around upcoming box office releases and highlight Hoyts as the best experience. Millennials are hard to target as they are discouraged by advertising and want brands to tell stories. They rely heavily on social media and cherish experiences they have with their friends. A lot of ideas I put forward was centered around group activity on social media. We collaborated and came up with a social media competition where participants were asked to pick their squad. The winner would receive six tickets to a premiere of the movie. This was aligned with the upcoming release of Suicide Squad. The idea is being proposed to Hoyts and we are waiting for a response. Updated competitive reports. I had to update competitive reports mainly for OPSM and Hoyts. It's important to know what your competition is doing. It helps us plan our media. So Specsavers are the number one spender in the optical market. So we have to be very strategic in how we planned our media in order to cut through. We need to know when, where and how they are advertising. We would also send these competitive reports to our clients so they can also see what the comp- competition is doing. Media plans. I had to build a media plan templates and help build actual media plans. So each year, Sunglass Hut runs a summer campaign. The campaign is based according to seasonality. The brand aligns with the summer feel and research indicates more products are sold during this period. We suggest a summer campaign to drown out other brands who maintain a yearly campaign. We dedicate our entire media spend to three months of the year rather than 12. Understanding what your comp- competitors are doing in the market from a media perspective allows for a more strategic planning and therefore greater reach. After evaluating the brand, it was evident that TV would be too expensive to include in the campaign. We brainstormed and proposed that there would be a large focus on out-of-home, radio, magazine, and online. Although we have a separate team who look after all things digital, we're still in the draft stage of planning process. The experience. The overall experience was so valuable, and I've learned so many new things. Putting the knowledge and theory I've learned throughout university to practice was rewarding. I had a sound knowledge of what a media media agency did. However, the experience has heightened my knowledge and I've learned new things that you can only get from real life work. The skills I acquired in the internship will be beneficial to me in the future. The culture of the industry is amazing. The work environment is the best I've ever worked in. I've been fortunate enough to receive an intent to employ letter and I hope to be working there by the end of the year.